Hi friends, good morning, welcome. Welcome back if you are returning and if this is your first time, welcome. So this morning I wanna bring to you these super, super cute soap slash lotion dispensers, whichever you'd like them to be for. So I got the dispenser itself from the Dollar Tree. I like this nice square body to it. And then we did an acrylic pour. So these turned out so super cute. So this one is in blues and grays. This one is red, yellow. I think there's some black in there. Some different colors. It's so pretty. Turned out super nice. Now with this, you can seal it any way you'd like. You can either do like Mod Podge over it. You can do spray Mod Podge. You could do a clear coat sealer spray. You can do polyurethane. I use the Crystallac Bright Tone on these. This is one of the things I had in mind for it. I did just two super thin coats on it. Turned out really well. Shiny, but not too shiny. You know, so you can make this matte. You can make it shiny however you like. But these just came out so absolutely darling. I love the acrylic pour on these. They look so, so, so nice. Now, I do have some of the, like, toothbrush holders. I was thinking that I might do, like, a matching toothbrush, tooth, I can't even speak today, toothbrush holder soap dispenser together. If I do, I'll bring it to you and show you. But I'm just really excited about these. So I hope you enjoy it. If you like it, please give the video a big thumbs up. Hit the subscribe button if you haven't already done so. And thank you so very much for the support and watching the videos. I so, so greatly appreciate it. And I hope that you like these. So the video on doing them is to come and I hope you have a blessed and beautiful rest of the day. Thanks friends. See you later. Bye. All right. So yours is going to be on a gray one. Yep. Yeah. Okay. So just pour in your red. Much. Um, however much you want. And you're going to go um, two of this to one of the pouring medium. So. Okay. Try to get it. Not too much very good. I think that's good. Okay. What other color are you going to do? Do you want to go white? Um, did you wear white yeah, now? Yeah, wear white out. Yeah. Yep. Okay. Yep. White in there. Do now you that, some yeah, not yet. Mm -hmm. You will, but not yet. Okay. The, um, the yellow already has a, um, pouring medium in it because it's that folk art modeling okay. one so you don't have to put pouring medium in it. And here's the black you can put it in that one. So the pouring medium is about two to one mm -hmm. but really like if you have a more liquidy um, paint mm -hmm. then you don't need as much if you have a thicker paint you need more so okay. really you're putting it into where it's like easy to pour you don't have to like be just you know pour some in and stir it and see how it feels because it, it's really about making it so that it pours easy and you know as long as it's nice and you know kind of pourable mm -hmm. okay. you're good yeah, I think that actually looks pretty good. All right, so now there you go, watch this. Watch this. Here, there. Yeah, put just a hair more, actually. If you want it to pour easy. Okay. Yep, yeah, you can put, put the rest of that in there and we'll open up another one. Oh. 
We can put them all individually, though, can't we? And not mix them together? You can, but it's not the same effect. Mm -hmm. No. Well, no. you're going to make that gray. You turn, it, turn it upside down or... Yeah. Oh, you did? You got paint on the floor? It's a payback because yeah, I got paint. I was doing a Harley Davidson cup and got orange on his garage floor, even though I said that I needed to be careful not to because he'd kill me, and he wasn't super happy with me. <laughs> so I, I complained about the back porch getting dirty all the time, and he just got paint on the back porch. So. With the one you just smeared and the one beside your other foot. <laughs> yeah, I, I this was, is the last wear. I was just going to ask you why you were wearing holy socks. Because you already washed them and I didn't want to waste the wash. Oh, is that so what it is? So wear them one more time and throw them out. Is that what yeah. it is? <laughs> Alright, so here's your cup you're going to pour it all into. So um, you can put it in however you want. It doesn't matter. I've taped up your um, your dispenser here because you don't want all your stuff to go inside it. I guess rubber plugs that work, I can bring home for that stuff if you want. I mean, if you're doing that. Oh. Like different sizes, like a short movie. Well, so also, though, because it the top screws on it, I also didn't want it to get in the screw but rims. I'm just offering up some ideas. But no, so. I appreciate it. That's it's a good idea. Because there's a lot of stuff that you can do that with. Want to put this on? Yep, put it in. Yes? Yep, just put it on top. Just pour it in. It kills you that it's not a precise you know, something being done precisely. It's got to be a procedure for it and everything. Even I know, I know. I, I could see it. I could see it killing you. This kind of shit will derail the whole job, dude. Watch your mouth. I'm sorry. This is tough. <laughs> then somebody's got to go look up a standard and call somebody and get a change made. And I know. I know. It kills you. Okay, here you go. Pour that in. I'm trying to not just dump in there because the, the shit didn't hit it so hard, so it stays on top of it. Stay separate. You're going to swirl it. I don't want to pour it like that. <laughs> I don't want to swirl it. Oh, you don't have to. If you don't want to swirl it, you don't have to so swirl it. Can you pour it. it like that? You can pour it however you want What's to. The it's your, What's the standard? The standard is whatever makes you happy. Okay, I want to it's it. art. It's not okay, it, it, It's not rocket, rocket science yeah. and rocket parts. Okay. It's art. So, yeah. I know you're not used to art. You're used to the other stuff. Let me show it here. As much as you would like. Yeah, well, creativity will get you in trouble. I'm not doing you know, too much creativity. Well, I know. I mean, my job, I use a lot of it, but some well, places don't. You know what? In my primary job, same thing. Well, I have, have to be creative in my I do job. Too, that's that's for sure. Work, but, that's do. but still, yes, I get what you're saying. So. Don't, so if it was a cup, you just pour it on the top, but don't because you'll just be wasting it. So with these, I pour like on the edges around. Okay. So just kind of pour on the edges. You're going to, don't be afraid. No, I will. I'll mix it later. All right. Like you're going to see pour, how I got some stuff rolling like, up top now. Dump, yeah, dump it and just pour, pour, pour. Like, okay. let it go all around. Yeah, that looks like Kung Fu. Mm -hmm. It does look like Kung Fu. It's going to be very interesting to see what, what kind of, oh, oh yeah, I'm, oh yeah, that's, that's good. Or the areas that yeah. aren't covered. I want to go right down from the top though, like if, if I did that right I know. Wow. Good? Mm hmm Oh, yeah, that looks good. Yeah. But, when, yeah, when you stick them there together, it makes, like, one color, so mm -hmm. you get them stuck over there, but they swirl. That's what I was thinking. Well, yeah, that's what I just kind of swirl. That is really, really cool looking. All right. Dude, that's amazing. So, I can't wait to see it dry. But this is the thing, like you would never look at this and think, oh, that was a Dollar Tree soap dispenser. Mm -hmm. 